Hey church family, good afternoon. I wanted to spend just a few minutes and give you all some more details and specifics on our upcoming trip to West Virginia. Um, I reached out to the director of missions, or one of them, uh, in the state of West Virginia and asked them to help us partner with somebody that needed some missionary type work done. Uh, in the past, uh, I've taken a trip to, where was that? St. Louis, Missouri, I think. We went to a women's shelter and uh, spent a week at the women's shelter doing some ministry there, building a stage uh, for their worship services on the weekends and then some painting and other things. And it was just a wonderful thing. I took all my kids um, and it was just, it was an, an amazing experience. And as I've been thinking about our church um, and our, our theme for the year is being all together uh, there's very few things that, that we can do that would bond us together than doing ministry together, like uh, significant ministry. So I reached out to one of the, the missionary directors in West Virginia just to ask him to help us find somewhere where we can partner. And I specifically asked for either a women's or children's types of shelters or um, churches that are getting some things done, that are doing things for the kingdom that just need some assistance. And uh, the, the, there are a lot of needs, um, significant needs actually from different churches. One church needed to jack up the entire um, building, the entire structure and replace all the floor joists, which I thought, man, that's a little bit too big of a job for us to do. Another uh, church needed a new roof put on their uh, facility, which another, again, that's just something that's too much for us to do. But then I found this one, it's a church plant. It was planted about 10 years ago. So they're almost the same age as us. They have recently purchased an old movie theater in their town. It's in Milton, West Virginia. And um, they, after purchasing the uh, movie theater, now they're purchasing the uh, properties adjacent to it. And this is what we're gonna be going and doing. The week after we return, is supposed to be the launch for whatever ministry they're using for one of the other buildings. Um, and so it just turned out to be a perfect opportunity for us to go up there and assist them in getting that place ready for uh, church, for their services the week after we leave. And so that's kind of what we're gonna be doing. I don't know exactly what the work entails, but I know it's taking this uh, existing building and doing whatever to make it for their church. So. Um, so we'll be leaving August the 31st, returning on September the 5th, I think, of the dates. Uh, the cost is going to be about $600 per person. Um, I can't give you an exact number because gas prices are going to fluctuate and food also, also fluctuates. Uh, but that's the only two variables that we don't have pinned down. So the hotel we're staying in is in a, in a community uh, down the road from this one. Um, and it's $99 per room for a double occupancy. So we'll just say it's $50 a person for the rooms. And then we're gonna be renting two 15 passenger vans. They're about $1,700 a piece. So if we have 20 or 25 people, it looks like we're gonna be able to make the trip happen, happen for about $600 per person. So if you're interested in going on this trip, I need to get some information and get a head count earlier than later. That way we can go ahead and secure the vans, secure the hotels, make sure we don't lose those reservations that we have, and just start really planning and getting together. Uh, that you all, all of us will get together that's going, and we'll talk, and we'll pray together. We'll do some devotions together and just get our hearts prepared for the work that the Lord's calling us there to do. So if you don't mind, um, send me an email. Let me know that you're if you're seriously interested, like I don't need 50 people that say I'm interested, but you don't really think that you're going to go. Um, like if you're seriously interested and the $600 isn't going to be a problem for you, um, then send me an email, mike at fuel.church. And there's no dot com at the end. It's just mike at fuel.church. Uh, that way over the next couple of weeks, I can hopefully get a really good head count on who'd like to go and just start planning the trip out because it'll be here before you know it. So um, again, Thanks for your time this afternoon. I love you guys. I can't wait to see you guys on Sunday. By the way, this past Sunday was just amazing. Worship was amazing. Church was amazing. 
Um, I didn't get to participate in the um, activities after church. Apologize for that, but I heard good things. Um, food was a little bit slow coming out, but that was all our fault. Uh, but anyway, uh, I just can't wait to worship with you guys again this week. I'm loving our church, and I love what the Lord's doing. So I love y'all. Uh, send me that email, like at fuel.church. Let me know you're interested in going, and then I'll be reaching back out to you in the next couple weeks to start putting some things together for us, okay? Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.